The eighth and most distant planet in the solar system, Neptune, is a mysterious, dark world. Because of its colossal distance from the Sun, it has only ever been visited by the Voyager 2 spacecraft back in 1989, which captured the first close-up images of the Neptunian system. The planet's atmosphere is mostly made up of hydrogen and helium, but its beautiful colour comes from methane and other components in the upper atmosphere absorbing red light and reflecting it as a magnificent vivid blue. Neptune has mostly been studied from ground-based telescopes, which means the planet still holds many unanswered questions about its icy interior. But because of the incredible Voyager 2 spacecraft and the data collected from Earth, scientists have been able to study many aspects of Neptune's structure and composition, giving them a greater understanding of what's inside of the mighty ice giant. So let's jump into a science fiction spacesuit and dive directly into this strange world to see what lurks deep below Neptune's mysterious clouds. Because this mission is impossible for any human being, let's assume that you have been equipped with special science fiction spacesuits. Suits that will take you all the way to the planet's core and protect you from the devastating environment that Neptune has to offer. Such as the frigid and scorching temperatures, deadly radiation, lack of oxygen and its colossal pressures. As you fall towards Neptune, you would have an incredible view of the planet's immense storms raging below you. You would be descending at a similar speed to if you were falling towards Earth, as Neptune's gravity is only 14% stronger than our own planets. Because you are so far away from the Sun, very little light reaches this distant part of the solar system, resembling a dim twilight back on Earth. You would first fall through the high, white cirrus clouds made of methane ice crystals at about 0.5 atmospheres, which is half the atmospheric pressure at sea level on Earth. At this altitude, it is incredibly cold, dropping to below minus 200 degrees Celsius. Around 30 miles down, you'd enter into the ammonia and hydrogen sulfide cloud decks at about 5 atmospheres. Here, the clouds move faster than the speed of sound on Earth, as Neptune experiences the fastest wind in the solar system, reaching speeds of up to 1,500 miles per hour. But because of your super science fiction spacesuit, you are kept steady and continue on your descent. Because of Neptune's thick clouds and distance from the sun, no light can penetrate this deep and you would find yourself in a pitch black, cold, lonely environment with violent winds whipping past your helmet. After falling for a long time, you would be 100 miles into Neptune when huge flashes of lightning illuminate your dark surroundings, revealing towering white water ice clouds that are causing rumbling thunderstorms to occur. As you pass through this cloud stage, the pressure would increase to well above 50 atmospheres and the temperature would be around 26 degrees Celsius. Using your high-tech science fiction helmet, you can now see what's around you, but you would quickly realise that the cloud layers were the easy part of your adventure. As you emerge from the bottom of the water ice clouds, the pressure would become intense and the temperature would drastically increase to above 1000 degrees Celsius. After a very long time of sinking, you would be around 4000 miles into Neptune and within the planet's mysterious mantle. Here, your suit would have to withstand pressures greater than 10,000 atmospheres and increasing temperatures higher than 4,000 degrees Celsius. This strange, superheated layer is composed of water, methane and ammonia ices that behave as a hot, dense fluid under immense pressures. 
Because of these extreme pressures, carbon atoms might also crystallize and form diamonds. As you descend ever closer towards Neptune's core, these diamonds would rain down around you like glittering hailstones as they slowly sink through the liquid mantle. After a long time of sinking through this thick region, with the pressures and temperatures continuing to drastically increase, your adventure would come to an end. Thousands of miles into the planet, you would be standing on Neptune's core, a surface roughly the same mass as Earth and made of rock, iron and exotic ices, possibly with a layer of nestled diamonds. In this region, you would be stranded, unable to travel further and unable to escape. You would be doomed to spend the rest of your life in a scorching environment with your science fiction suit having to withstand temperatures of above 5000 degrees Celsius and pressures of above 7 million atmospheres. I really hope you enjoyed this video, if you did then hit the like button and subscribe for much more to come. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.